Good morning. Welcome to Triada Bay. I'm having me a last fishing session. It has been disappointing this week, although not unexpected really, because I've already detailed it. I was going to bring my beach gear, but getting over COVID, I didn't feel particularly as if I wanted to lug everything around, following the tides up and down. So I decided anyway, just to bring the one rod and have a go for early wrasse. Unfortunately, they're, they're not here. <laughs> That's obvious because the place where I am during the summer months, I catch lots of fish. Even my wife with a hand line has caught numerous wrasse from off the rocks, not just here, but elsewhere in Anglesey as well. Disappointed? No, not really. Is this a disaster? Most certainly not. I'm fishing like I am today, sitting out in the fresh air, enjoying it. It was snowing yesterday as well. I was in Plangevney for a football game, ground hopping, and the snow was coming down just briefly, but it just shows that we're still not out of the, the winter yet properly, are we? And of course, whether it's course, sea or game, it's about the water temperature, isn't it? And in particular, the water temperature does not catch up with the air, although it was nice the start of the week it has gone a bit chilly last couple of days so it will be another few weeks before the rats come in for me though today three weeks time and i'll be 60 years old i'm looking forward to it not being 60 it's not that i want to get older i'm not bothered because it's a natural thing it's a an inevitable consequence of the passing of time for all of us it doesn't matter who we are whatever age we are it will catch up with us one day but for me personally i see it as a time of a new season new opportunities and in particular it's about going part-time so reducing my hours i can remember when my dad was my age and i went to see him one day he was at home and he was chatting to me and he said he worked at Bagridge Brick, which is no longer there. But he said to me, he said, I'm coming 60 and I can retire with a certain pension. But if I go to 65, then that pension becomes considerably more. So that's what I'm going to do. And do you know what? He never made 65. He died of cancer in the meantime. And I think that's a lesson for all of us, isn't it? that you never know what's around life's corner. If there's an opportunity now, grasp it, because it might not come around in a few years time. So as far as I'm concerned anyway, I'm not, I'm not living in fear, like my dad died at this age of his life. I don't think I might die. I, mean, I don't know, we, none of us know, do we, what the future holds, but what I am going to do is make the most of the present. So three weeks to go, and then I'll be going part-time. Not sure yet, all the details, crossing the T's and dotting the I's, as they say, need to work out a, a few things really. But the most important thing is, I will be taking that first step and I'm looking forward to it. Holidays, leisure, all that sort of stuff that comes with it. I'm looking forward to it. And fishing! And then I will be back on Anglesey during the summer and I'll be catching some wrasse for sure, even if I'm not getting any this week. In fact, I'm not getting anything at all this week. But I've thoroughly enjoyed it because we've done other things as well, which is great.